Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today on a Pixie Planner Life, I'm going to be doing a monthly plan with me for April 2021. So if you want to see how I'm planning this layout, stick around because that's coming up right now. Hey you guys, welcome back and like I said today, I'm going to be doing a monthly spread in my classic happy planner for the month of April for 2021 and it is Easter month and spring is finally full on and I'm so excited and today I am actually going to be using a monthly sticker kit it's the very last one that I have from all of the monthly kits that I had acquired over the last couple of years and I am trying to get rid of a lot of my kits. And this one is super cute. It's a super old one that I got from Fabulously Planned Co. And it's just this really fun, eastery, spring, April vibes kit. And it is made for the Erin Condren, but it usually fits pretty well in the Classic Happy Planner as well. And I'm going to be combining these adorable Happy Planner floral stickers. These are from the Fun Floral Sticker Book. And I think that they go perfect with this sticker kit. So that is my plan today. I'm going to keep it pretty simple. And it's going to kind of be a speed plan with me. I'm not going to talk much in this, but I'm not considering it a short series either. Just because I did want to explain kind of what I was doing. <laughs> and with the quick speed plan with me's, I don't always have time to do that. So those are more just watch me plan fast type videos. So yeah, I'm going to have to do a little bit of whiting out on this. So I'm going to start kind of doing all that and I'll speed you up for that. And then I will come back and show you how I kind of set this up and then we'll finish up at the end. So Let's just get right into it. So it turns out that there isn't that much that I need to white out. Just a couple of these Mickey heads a little bit. And then I'll probably have to do a little bit over here as well, but I actually don't need to cover up that much. So I am just going to lay down like my headers and my numbers, and then I will come back and do the more deco portion of this with you guys. So let's go. Okay, you guys, so now that I have all of that done, um, what I want to do next is I want to, I think I want to decorate my Easter box. 
I'm just trying to think what color I want to highlight. I'm thinking probably, I'm thinking yellow. I just hope it's not too much. Or maybe we'll do purple. Maybe I'll do like a pastel purple. I have this pretty lavender purple. I think maybe I'll just do that. And I'm just going to go in and highlight. Yeah, I like that. Um, I don't know if I need those. I mean, I guess I'll highlight them because they're there. And then for Easter, I have these cute little bunnies. And I think, I think I want to put this guy right here. Because he's just so cute. And maybe the little basket here. That's really cute. All right. So I have a couple of things that are going on that I want to use. And I think, do I want to use these little ones or do I want to use these bigger fun ones? I've got one, two, three, four, and there are four here. Why don't we go ahead and use the bigger ones? So I have one, two, three, four, five spots where I could put these. I don't think I want to put them all here. I'm thinking I want to do some kind of floral here. I think I'm going to put this blue one down here. And then I'm going to take a purple and yellow one, I'm thinking. I'm thinking this one. And just kind of putting it like this. And then I'm going to cut this up. And the beauty about doing it like this is it gives me extra stickers for another part of the layout. If it doesn't throw in the thing. And then like I could probably put this somewhere up here. Or I could put it right here. Why don't we put it let's put it up here. And then we'll do the bottom as well. And then maybe we can put that one over here. Or, hmm, maybe we'll put that right here. That's cute. And then I think for the box down here, I want to do this white one. Either that or this one can go. Ooh, that's what's up there, huh? I really want to use this. So I'm kind of thinking this should go here. So I'm just going to go for it. Okay, so I finally got that on. Unfortunately, it did pick up a little bit of the paper and the sticker over there, but it is what it is. I'm not sure if I love that. <laughs> um, but it's done. So I almost kind of wish I used the sticker over here now. This one can go here. And I'm gonna put this one down. It's just like 
a lot of pink right next to each other. You know what? I have an idea. I'm going to peel this off and hopefully it comes off okay. Hopefully it resticks. We're going to put this one over here. I know it's a lot of eggs in one spot, but that's what I want to do. And then I want to put this white one down here. Like that. And then this one I'm going to cut down. Okay. So I just cut that down and put that there because you guys know I'm all about balance and I didn't want the pink like that. So, okay, so now that those are in, now I can go ahead and do these boxes. So I'm going to use this yellow one for here. I think I'm going to put it like up here. Like that and I'm just gonna go ahead and write this in and then the next one I guess the next one will do the same as this one because I don't want two blue small boxes over here so this one can go here we'll put this one lower and we'll write that in. Okay. And then for right here, we'll put this in. A little overlapping. We'll just do that like that. All right, and then the last one I have is this one. And we'll put this one down here since it matches that other one. Okay, so now that's done, um, I do have these Bill Do stickers. I'm not sure if I want to use them or not. Um, they're kind of big and there's already a lot going on and I still wanna add some more flowers. So what I might do is I might actually use a combination of these with these but that only gives me one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and I think I have like 12. All right, I think I'm gonna have enough, so I'm gonna put the rest of these down, finish decorating, and then I'll be back.
All right, you guys, that is it. I am all done. So it's definitely not my favorite spread. Um, I always feel constricted when I use a kit. I used to love them and use them all the time, but I'm kind of evolving. And as my planner style evolves, I find that I like kits less and less. So as I've said before in previous videos, I am trying to use up a lot of the kits that I have, which is why I'm still using them. But I'm not a huge fan of them anymore. I'm really not. I find that I do still love sweeping plans kits, but even those I am combining with other stickers. My Disney kits seem to still be my favorites, but anything else non-Disney, I just can't seem to get into it anymore as far as kits are concerned. So I am happy that this is the last of the monthly kits. I can go back to using Happy Planner stickers for my monthlies from now on, but it's definitely got Easter spring vibes, so I'm happy with that. And I was glad that I was able to find some florals that went pretty well with the kit. So I'm happy with this and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget if you're not already subscribed to the channel, I would love it if you would do so by hitting the subscribe button down below. And that's it. I will see you guys in the next video. Happy planning and stay magical. Bye.